I am the only woman in Nigeria to have slapped a babio. Dr. Nune exposes sexual harassment as NDDC field get messier. The NDDC has been in the news lately for alleged mismanagement of funds and contract splitting from parliamentary hearings to media reports where the immediate past MD of the interventionist agency has accused the minister Senator Akpabio of graft and intimidation. Yeah. Earlier today, on an interview at Arise TV, the back and forth allegations took another personal twist when Dr. Nune revealed that she slapped the ex Aquaibom state governor. She said, I am the only woman in Nigeria to have slapped Akpabio, says Dr. Joy Nune, detailing the incident when Minister. Goswil Akpabio wanted to take advantage of her in his guest house. The ex NNDC boss Joy Nunye also told Arise TV that NDDC Minister Akpabio demanded $1 million for Xmas. Also spoke on how his diesel supplier girlfriend approached Secretary Nas NDDC C. NDDC committee to insert project in the 2020 budget. Details later. Well, a lot have been said so far on social media against Akpabio. In fact, it has been said that if Akpabio should steal what he stole as a governor in Akwaibom State, then there will be no NDDC again. The man is fantastically corrupt. I pity him because he may die soon as he has no stamina to withstand what Mago is going through. Yet he is brutally wicked and devilish. His time is up. He can't fool us anymore. This woman allegation should not be ignored. Please. Hmm. A lot is happening right now. President Buhari is not available. Thus, anything goes. If Abakiari were to be alive, Magu will remain in a saint. Akpabio will remain a minister. Nothing has been heard of this EFCC case before his appointment. Well, I know some folks here whom are beneficiary of the corrupt system will be saying nonsense. Okay. Buhari's government smelling corruption all over the country. Well, this is serious. No wonder Akpabio refused to appear before the Senate for questioning. Akpabio is also accusing her of having fulfilled marriages. Mr. Akpabio Nawau. Okay, this is serious sexual harassment everywhere. These people are criminals. Well, they are criminals in power with no certificate. Oh my God, a lot is being said here right now. Well, they shall know the truth and that will set her free. Like Magu, the minister should be suspended while investigations continues. This lady should be well protected. Thank you, madam, for your bravery. Okay. Thank you, madam, for your bravery. Yes, there's this word that I always say. Mm, it is not funny at all. The word says, Oleni, everybody. Any lemobani barao. Yes, and that is it. Meaning, everyone is a thief, but he who is caught, that is who you call barao. Well, you are not caught doesn't mean you are not a thief. That is the political terms. That is what is happening in Nigerian politics right now. May the good Lord continue to help us all in Jesus' name. A lot is happening. Yes, people have said it that this woman is brave and she needs to be protected. Well, she needs to be well protected because a lot have been happening. What about some of the women that are just scared to... 
alter this out. In fact, some of them would not even be able to raise their hands, let alone slapping someone like a Fabio. Well, she has revealed the whole thing. May the good Lord continue to protect us all in this country. That is politics for you. Well, that is it, my people. Meanwhile, let me have your take on this. And remember to subscribe for more updates. Thanks and God bless.